Hello, welcome to Buffy's Deals YouTube channel. Today we're going to be talking about real work from home jobs and we're going to give average annual salary figures. Now these are positions that require little experience. Of course you will need some skills and abilities such as writing, knowing technology, being able to communicate, but as far as having experience in the fields, you do not need that to start out and earn one of these work from home positions. So let's get started. First off, you might be asking, what is a work from home job or WFH for short? It's just what it says, you work from home. You don't have to fight traffic. You don't have wear and tear in your car. You don't have to worry about gas prices. If you're riding public transportation, you don't have to worry about the weather. Is the bus gonna be on time? That sort of thing. There's also minimal, minimal startup costs for you. You usually need a computer, mobile phone, and internet connection. And most companies you work for will provide the computer or mobile telephone. You just provide the internet connection. Now, what are some work from home jobs that require very little experience? First up, data entry clerk. Average salary annually is 23000 to 60000 Typically, you'll take information from one source and you'll put it in another one. So you may get some, some mail that you take information from an address, uh, other points of contact information, and you put it in a computer or into a spreadsheet. Usually, you will need to have at least a high school diploma, be able to type, be able to read, and you must have attention to detail because, again, you're taking data from one source, putting it in another, so you need to have attention to detail to prevent errors when transferring that data. Another position is a virtual assistant. Average annual salary is 20000 to 60000 Typically, you'll make appointments, keep a calendar, and data entry. And you usually need the following skills in order to succeed as a virtual assistant. You need to have organization skills, you need to be able to multitask, pay attention to detail, and you need to know your way around technology. Another one is a graphic designer. Average annual salary for that starting out is $35,000 to $65,000 a year. Typical job duties includes creating graphics and other design work. And you usually need the following skills in order to succeed as a graphic designer. A good portfolio of prior work, and you can work full-time or as a freelancer when you try to become a graphic designer. <clears throat> English as a second language teacher. Approximate starting salary for this is 30000 to 65000 And your typical job duty is just what it says. You teach English as a second language. and You can teach this to students throughout the world. Requirements for this position, of course, you need to know the English language, you can teach others, um, and you can get certifications which will help you get that position even quicker. TESOL, teaching English to speakers of other languages. You just teach English as a second language or as a foreign language to others. There's another certification, TEFL, teaching English as a second language. Something similar to that is a tutor. Average annual salary, 22,000 to 80,000. And you typically, you're teaching a subject or subjects to your students. And you usually need the following, a bachelor's degree or master, master's degree in the subject that you're teaching. A lot of teachers do this part-time, either in the evenings or during the summer for extra money. Customer support representative. Average annual salary is 25,000 to 50,000. Typical job duty, provides support to a cu company's customers via email, phone, or chat. And you definitely need to have good writing and verbal communication skills in order to succeed as a customer service rep. Content writer. Average annual salary is $34,000 to $75,000 a year. Typical job duty, you create content 
for web articles and blog posts. And you usually need the following skills, definitely good writing skills, and you need to have an online writing portfolio to show potential employers, um, this is what I can do because this is what I've done in the past. Proofreader. Average annual salary is 27000 to 70000 Typical job duty, you read content before it's published, online or in print, for grammatical issues. Definitely need strong English language skills, and it's preferred to have a bachelor's or master's in English, which may help you get a job as a proofreader. Social media evaluator. Average annual salary is about 38000 Typical job duty, you evaluate social media content to make sure it's meeting specific guidelines. Definitely need strong English language skills and you need to know technology. Social media manager. Average annual salary is about $35,000 to $80,000. Typical job duties. You manage a company's social media channels, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, TikTok. And skills you need for this position, you need to know social media platforms. You need to be creative and, good, and have good writing abilities. A copywriter. Average annual salary is between $38,000 to $78,000. And your typical job duty is writing for a company's website email marketing or copy and your main goal for doing all of that writing is to drive revenue to the company skills usually required for this is a portfolio of prior work definitely good writing abilities and sales copy writing knowledge software engineer average annual salary is between sixty five thousand to one hundred and thirty thousand dollars and you usually, um, you're doing software engineering, basically coding for a company. So you need to have a knowledge of programming languages. Of course, the more languages you know in programming, the better off you'll be. And you also need to have the ability to learn new programming languages. Now, where do you go? You want to get one of these positions. Where do you go to try to find them? And here's some websites. LinkedIn, Zip Recruiter, Glassdoor, salary.com I have another page of them dynamite.com indeed.com goabroad.com careerbuilder.com any of these positions that we've discussed go to these websites put them in their search form and you can find some positions these there's so many companies out there hiring every day for work from home positions Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. And if you did, please give me a like, add a comment, and share the video. Also, please consider subscribing to this channel and hit the notification button so you'll be notified when I add more videos. I'm going to be adding videos on self-help, motivational videos, also a few recipes, deals, and tips on how to make and save money as well. Thank you again for watching, and Happy New Year.